Jakemi, everybody. Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons Part 4. This is day... really only day 2 for me. We've been having a really good time with the game so far. It's a nice lazy Saturday morning. My kids are happily playing Super Mario 3D World. They love it. Hello, Nook. Look at that cute yellow bird there. Hello everyone, this is Tom Nook. It's 6.48 a.m. this sad, happy Saturday, March 21st, 2020. There's really not much news today, so instead I'll share some valuable tips about tonight's show living. Are you making good use of the resident recycle box? The recycle box stores items and our, res our residents don't need any more. I'm having trouble reading today. Good gravy. <clears throat> Stores items our residents don't need so someone else can pick them up later. Yeah, we've, we've checked that out a bit. You might find treasures other folks have left there if you check it from time to time, you know. I want to make those patches. I want to make an Animal Crossing patch like that and put it on my backpack. That would be cool. Like he's got on his shirt. That's all from me. Bye now. It's funny how they've started doing these little news bits like they do in Splatoon. I wish that there were other shows that you could do, or that they would do, like a top 40 countdown where they do the, the radio or something else that you could actually tune into, have it sort of, oh my, my campfire, I left it burning all night long. Actually, no I'm not. I'm going to keep playing. I meant to put the campfire back down, I just wanted to turn it off. Oh no, I'm gonna break my net, aren't I? Okay, there we go. Campfire's turned off. Just gonna pick up some sticks. Actually, I was gonna do some nook miles first, wasn't I? That's what I Oh, my umbrella. Good, I need this. I think I gotta go put something on the bullet. Oh. I got antsy. <laughs> I knew that I was going to do that way too early. No, come back. Oh. oh, wow. My net even hits the water. That's cool. Okay, butterflies, come back. Come back over here. Yo, here we go. Ooh, that's a big one. There's nothing. No. Come back! <laughs> I can't cross the river yet, butterfly. Come to me. Ready? <clears throat> yes! A tiger butterfly. I've earned my stripes. They have those in Vernal. I've seen those in real life. They're pretty. Oh no! Oh no! I didn't get the catch! And I just got stung by wasps! Oh man, stung by wasps. I gotta go get some medicine. What a way to start out Saturday morning with my face all messed up. Where am I gonna get some medicine anyways? Do they sell it in resident services? Good thing I'm not allergic. <clears throat> Sorry, I've got a little hoarse voice this morning. I have been having a sore throat. And that's part of the reason I had to stay home from work for these last few days. They wanted me to be quarantined so that I... I wouldn't get anybody else sick. And then we had the earthquake, so everybody had to be closed down. Ni hao, that was my wife's. Let's see. I'll draw something happy here. Look at these, look at these Joy-Con skills. Now that's good right there. That's a good flower. <laughs> kind of. 
I don't have green, do I? There's no green. And that's still pretty good. I'm satisfied. Oh, that was not as good as it could have been. How do I go back? Here we go. Oh, I can go right off the edge. I thought it would stop me at that little green thing, but it didn't. March 21st, we had the vernal equinox, I think, yesterday. So this really is like first day of spring, isn't it? Oops. Or yesterday was the first day of spring, maybe. <laughs> Those are sunglasses, by the way. <laughs> my son is, my son has sunglasses on. There we go. I got some nook miles building up here. Make the most out of island life. I would read this, but we did it just last night with my wife's. I like how you get different stamps. And the little sound effects are nice. Even drinking water, I can't get my voice to go back to normal. I thought maybe I need to eat or drink some water, but it's just not working out today. I kind of rumor mongering influencer. Hey, I, that's not very nice, is it? I'm not mongering rumors, I'm just putting flowers on the bulletin board. What's this one? Planting flowers? Sell fruits, sell seashells, oh yeah, fish in a row without getting one getting away. More furniture. I think I have some furniture. Let's talk to Tammy. Hello Tammy, you're looking very pretty this morning. What kind of fish are you going to meet? I don't know, but I'm sure it'll be lovely. She didn't look at me, is that why she didn't notice that I have a swollen face? <laughs> They're laughing. Don't laugh at me, Tom. Look at how much he's laughing at my poor face. Do you have medicine, Jimmy? Let's sell some stuff. Sell some apples. Uh, sell some weeds. No, wait, the hermit crab's a bug. I want to keep that one. <laughs> I have suddenly developed a cough. Maybe I do have coronavirus. I'm probably a relatively high risk person because when you eat food like fruit, you'll find yourself energized with more power than you might have imagined. I didn't know that. What I mean is you can break open rocks or dig up a whole tree if you had the right tool. It's fine for you to sell me your fruit, but you should try eating it once in a while, too. I don't really want to break the rocks, though, do I? Anyways, I, because I work in a clinic and I see a lot of people in fairly close proximity, I'm kind of, kind of wondering if I've been exposed and didn't know it. Nook salutes you for your beautification efforts. Oh, 200 weeds. That's a lot of weeds. Oh, I should check out what's on the rest of this little phone here. How do I get my phone again? There we go. Okay. 
it said there was something new on here, I thought. Custom designs. When you save custom designs in the app, you can share them with other island residents. There's a chance other people will see your custom designs. Please don't create anything vulgar, basically. Yeah, private information and offensive words or images. Well, hopefully the Animal Crossing community. Please access Nook link under game specific services for info on reading custom design QR codes. So that's how you can bring them in from other games. You can pull it in on your phone with that Nintendo Switch app. Yeah, hopefully the Animal Crossing community is a lot more. Hey, I can wear that. Oh, cool. I can change my shirt. That's a nice looking shirt. Is it a tank top? <laughs> I think I'm going to wear this airplane shirt. It's awesome. Or maybe this flower shirt? No, no. Airplane it is. Face paint. Let me see here. Let's change a design. I'm, I guarantee I'll get some nook points for this. Wow, this is... This is quite robust. A line tool, a circle. I should give myself a skin cancer scar because I didn't use my umbrella enough. Mirror mode. Yeah, there we go. Let's do that. That way, whatever I design will be a little bit... We'll make it a fresh wound. How about that? Very thin line. Good. Pretty long. They always end up a little bit longer than people think they're going to be. And we'll close it. No, wait. We want it, we want it red. A thin red line. Good, good. Oh, wow. I can bend it. Interesting. Okay. Now we need... We'll close it with some proline. Proline is blue. I could have done a, a flap, like a rhombic flap. Okay, I think we're done with mirror mode. Hmm, just a little bit, a little bit left over in the middle there, huh? Well, that's gonna bug me because it's not symmetric. That's okay. Nothing in life is perfect. Sometimes your stitches don't end up perfectly straight. <laughs> As much as I'd like them to be, sometimes you don't end up with perfect stitches. Let's see. Design B. This will be, I will call this creation, post hop. Post hop, day one. There we go, I'll post off day one. Now let's wear this scar. Oh wait, not that. <laughs> oh, I am having trouble with the buttons this morning. Okay, let's go back. Now wear it, okay, face paint. Oh, that's not exactly what I thought was going to happen, is it? Well, that's interesting. I'm going to have to change it. Oops. Let's change it. I didn't make skin color. Let's erase everything. Can I... How do I just erase the whole thing? There's got to be a button for that. Oh, here we go.
fill all with skin color. Well, at least the skin color that I've got right now. I'll keep editing. I don't want to discard. Now, let's draw another line. I don't really need mirror mode. I'll put this card down here, maybe. Well, that's not really in line with... So up here on the forehead, I could hide it right in the forehead lines. There we go. Yeah, yeah, we'll do a... This is where my skin cancer was, right there. A thin line, almost can hide in the hairline. We'll put some prolines on there to close up my wound. Now these are not the deep stitches, but I'll do the rule of halves. That way I don't end up with a funny looking suture line again. That's probably good. I don't think you'd need much more than that on there. Good. There we go. There's my post-op day one. Now let's wear it on my face. Oh, it's hidden in my hair. I'm having trouble with this. I did a really good job on that surgery. Can I just drag design? There we go. Drag it down a little bit there. There we go, it's perfect. My skin tone doesn't match exactly, but that's okay. I'll leave it for now. Let that scar heal and then I'll remove it. Ooh, 500 nook miles for that, all right. I've almost got my house paid off, I'm pretty sure. He puts his book away to talk to me. That's polite of you, Tom. Oh, how could I forget? Hmm? I give, I should give you a brief explanation about the terminal. That's our Nook Stop. It's a terminal for services that will further enhance your island life. At the moment, you can use two services, Jimmy. The first is Nook Shopping. It's a catalog shopping service for items that can be hard to find on an island. I'm going to set my little timer here. That way I don't play for too long. It's a catalog shopping service that for items that can be hard to find. Second, the terminal serves as an automatic bell dispenser, or ABD. For the Bank of Nook. You even own the bank. Oh, man. We're also working, working on Wooking. <laughs> you kind of do look like a Wookiee, in a way, on a service by which you'll be able to redeem Nook miles for various things. That would be nice. Please take advantage of these wonderful services. Quite beneficial. Yes, yes, indeed. Welcome to Nook Stop, a multimedia terminal from Nook, Inc. Once per day, accessing the Nook Stop will award you bonus daily miles. Oh, wow. So I missed that yesterday, didn't I? Uh, automatic bell dispenser. Deposit. Yeah, sure, I'll put some bells in there. It's always good to, de to save about... Honestly, you should really be paying yourself about 20% of your take-home income. So that would be... 5,500 is 10. Right? I'm doing that. I'm doing that math right. So 11,000 in my savings account. Or not 11,000, 1,100. Okay. Pay yourself first. Live on the difference. Personally, I do save 20% into a retirement account. Some of it's pre-tax. Some of it's actually after tax. Max, you got to max out a Roth IRA if you can. And then I do 10% into charity. So I got my savings account started. What can I do in Nook Shopping? Camping cot? I should buy one for Tammy. She doesn't have, ooh, a record player. A rain, oh, I need that. I wouldn't have to use my umbrella if I had my wide brimmed hat. Okay, I gotta buy that. Oh, and I better buy one for my wife too. Yeah, Carissa, you gotta protect yourself. He 
What's a, what's a good dermatology approved one that looks like this is good. Uh, well, she is my wife. I got to do so many hearts. I wanted to express my appreciation for all that you do for me. That's why I decided to get you this gift. I hope you like your shiny new rain hat. Um, stay safe in the sun. Safe in the sun. What other characters have we got here? Can I send little heart emojis? There are lots of. Oops. There we go. I wish I could go quickly from English to the. UK English? Really? Is our keyboard different? Tell me if it is. I don't know there was. I wish there was a button here that I could just do like a hotkey to symbols. Yep, I will send a rain hat. Okay, Carissa, be careful. Hola. <laughs> Can I make those into sunglasses? Culottes? Those look a little bit like female shorts. I think I'm probably not going to be buying those. Oh, those are awesome. Okay. Hypno KK. I gotta have that too. Okay, I'm out of bells. I need a record player. I guess I'm done. I'm not going to pull money out of my savings account for that. That's my emergency fund. How do I pay off my debt to you anyways? Hello Jimmy, what would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. About my moving fees. Oh, you like to pay your moving fees? Well, you owe 5,000 miles. Let's talk when you've had a chance to earn a few more. Okay, so I guess the thing to do right now is just to catch some bugs and fish. And pull weeds. It's good to see you, Jimmy. I'm enjoying it, except my face is swollen. Shaking trees or cutting them down can sometimes knock loose a wasp nest. Yes, I know. Your face is all puffy. A oh, puffy f folks, puffy faced folks get restung and then faint. What happens if I faint? If I were you, I'd carry some with me at all times. Oh, well, I'm glad you told me. Let me get some of that medicine. I don't want to faint. What happens if you faint? Oops, I missed. Here we go. Do you have some medicine? I need some. No, I don't want to sell. I wanted to buy. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. What's for sale? Oh, what's this? A smoker and a lawn chair? That would make for an awesome... Oh, flowers. Can I plant flowers? Or do I have to have a shovel to plant flowers? I thought you said you had medicine in here. A cedar sapling? A sapling? Oh, there's the medicine. Let's buy two. Ah, I don't have enough for five. That's just like real life. Medicine is expensive. Can't I use GoodRx to get my prescriptions for cheaper? My insurance apparently isn't covering as much as I thought it would. This game is too much like real life. I can't even afford my medicine. What is it? Okay, yeah, I need this for sure.
Boy, these guys are really milking me for everything. They bring me to this island where there's nothing. They tell me that I do it myself, and then they sell me the recipes for how to build it. <laughs> okay, well... I think maybe I do have coronavirus. I'm getting the cough. I've been sick for a, a week now. I started with a sore throat. And I I never really had a fever, but I know my, my kid had a fever. And I think that's all I need for now. I sort of have expended my my expendable cash. My savings account is still healthy. I need to put on my sun hat. Wait a minute. Where is my hat? It should look like a hat, right? Maybe they... Interesting. Where did my hat go? I know I bought one. Is it in my tent? Oh, I can place, I can hang it on my wall. Let's hang up my shirt. Oops, no, I don't want, I keep thinking minus is my inventory button for some reason. Hang it on the wall. I can't hang things on tent walls. Okay, well, let's put that over on the left side here. Because, oh, it's red. I think that red things are supposed to go on. I think red things are supposed to go on the right side for feng shui. The Nintendo Switch is... No, wait. Red must go here because I put the apple here. Trust yourself. Okay. I'll put this shirt right here. I know it doesn't look like much, guys, but... Okay, and green must go on that part. Portable radio. I guess that counts as furniture. Still get to my tent that way, okay. Let's fill this up. I needed to display more furniture, right? Put a campfire over in the corner. I won't turn it on, I'll just leave it there for now. And a radio. Oh! I can put it on the box! Perfect! I need a box for my Switch. Put a fish in here, maybe? A hermit crab. A hermit crab makes a good pet. Yeah, look at him. Look how cute he is in his little hermit crab case. Okay, let's go with that. I didn't get an award for furniture, so maybe that wasn't furniture. I got some more nook miles. All right. It's because I'm a hoarder now. An interior sort, okay. I'm getting real close. I gotta talk to Sly. Where is Sly today? I also need to make a flimsy pole. I might have to do some weed picking off stream. 
That's not particularly interesting. But I need to pick a lot of weeds. Okay, I gotta catch 10 fish in a row without missing. I'm gonna have to write down a list of things. I'm gonna have to use my, my medical student skills, making lists and checking things off my list. That's a pretty fish, a yellow perch. Those yellow birds have to sit somewhere. <laughs> I love the puns. I love fish puns. Although if you guys like watching me pick weeds, I guess let me know. I can keep picking weeds, not on... Not off stream. He has mail. My son has mail. I can't check his mail. Hey Sly, what's up? Ew, uh, oh no, my face! <laughs> Maybe you're going for a new look, but that seems extreme. Wow, whatever has got, whatever got you has definitely not been skipping Stinger Day. I wish I had some medicine to give you, but I don't want to mess up my aerodynamics, so I didn't bring any. But I can show you how to make medicine. It's easy to do, and this island's got everything you need. That last thing you want is to get stung so much you faint. Fainting really cuts into your lap times. It cut into my face, too. The wasps, I fainted and I cut my face. That's why I have those stitches. Make sure to keep some medicine on you. Hoorah! Thanks, Sly! Apparently, if you talk to somebody when you have a stung face, they'll teach you how to make medicine. I wonder what I have to use. I hope it's weeds. <laughs> Let's take my medicine. I'm all better now. I forgot about that. I forgot that I had medicine. How do I make it? A hay bed. A stone. A stone stool. I need a hay bed. I can make a hay bed for my girlfriend, Tammy. A wash tub to wash my clothing. A wooden block toy, I can give that to my son. <gasps> An ocarina. I wonder if I can play it. I need a wasp nest. I just sold a wasp nest. Oh, man. This is cool. I'm really, I'm really digging this little Nook Miles system and the DIY thing. I wonder if it'll age well with me or if I'll get tired of it. Reward you based on the DIY recipes you collected. Very cool. Let's see about catching some bugs, I guess. Oh, but first, there's a message in that bottle and I need it. Come here, butterfly. I caught you once before, but maybe I'll go for this yellow one. Oh, he walks painfully slow when he holds it. Shouldn't all butterflies be yellow? I see what you did there. Bug puns are good as- they're almost as good as fish puns. I caught a common butterfly, they often flutter by. Oh, there's the shiny thing on the ground again. So I need a wasp nest again to make some medicine. I wonder if I can sell medicine. I wonder how much it brings in if I produce my own medicine. It seems like it should be fairly lucrative, the way they overcharged me for five. I should go in here, I haven't been in the Dodo Airlines yet. Hey, 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 welcome to your one and only getaway to the skies, the Tonight Show Airport. Nice to meet you. I'm Orville. Oh, like Wilbur and Orville from the Rescuers Down Under. <laughs> Just kidding. I know it's from the Wright Brothers. Dodo Airlines. The crew may be flightless, but that doesn't mean you have to be. Hey, I love your logo. I love your slogan. That's amazing. If you want to visit another island or invite friends, this is the place to do it. We've also got a mail service. Sometimes the letter's just better, you know? If you want to take someone a, send someone a note, take a gander. We've got all kinds of cards. By the way, you're Jimmy, right? It's a small island. Word gets around. So, Jimmy, you got anything to tell me? I'm good right now. Come back anytime. If you want to visit me, hit me up in the messages here, the comments. I'd love to have some visitors to my island. I can do a card for 200 bells. Yes, I am ready. 
I want to send it to a resident. Oh, a future self. I wonder why you would mail yourself a future self. Let's send one to Tammy. Write your letter on it. I love, I love that they're stationary. Let's be, let's be a little subtle and send her ones with roses on it. Yeah. Elegant roses. Say, this is also probably not interesting. I should probably make my letters off stream. So maybe I'll have to play for a few minutes and take care of a few things. I'll have to make a list again and make a list of things to do off stream. Demi, your eyelashes are perfect. Yeah, I should pick weeds and do letters off stream and then pick up the stream from there. Your eyelashes are cute. There we go. Oh, I can send a gift. What should I send her? A sand dollar? That's maybe junk. Will she like a sand dollar? Will you let Tammy? I need to protect you as well with an umbrella. Two hundred bells. Letter sent. All right. Tammy and I are on our way. And I do like Sly, so let's send Sly one. Yep, yep, let's send one to Sly. Gotta make friends with him too. To my little boy. He always makes himself a darker skinned girl on games. I'm not sure why. I think it's because his best friend in New York was Saudi Arabian, a little Saudi Arabian girl. And so I think that's why, but he always he always picks like fifth Patrick skin type four or five sometimes. And always is a girl. <laughs> you're too 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 you're too swall. Boys, okay. We'll give we'll give him a sand dollar, I guess. I know I'm supposed to be selling those, but surely I'll get Nook Miles for sending letters too, right? I love the little TV. The details in here. They have a bamboo. Uh, what is that thing? A banana tree in the background there. They say no water bottles, no liquid. It's just like a real airport. A carry-on measure here. The TV, the old-fashioned CRTV. That even looks like it has a refresh rate. <laughs> oh, but your sign is crooked. That's bothering me. Look at the look at the rope. It looks like the nails are not evenly spaced. Somebody designed that. I can sit here and wait. Very nice. Nice little airport. It looks cute. I can't believe I didn't get Nook Miles for that. I'm kind of surprised. Back to fishing. No fish, huh? Slow fishing day. There we go. I do have to catch a lot of bugs. I sure wish I had a shovel so I could dig up that thing, whatever it is. Here, fishy fishy. This one's a triangle shape. What is it? It's hard for me to catch them when they're when they bite the first time for some reason. I get nervous. I get nervous and I push the button too soon or too. What is that? Little bugs?
A wharf roach. This water-loving roach has no peer, but I can't carry anything else. Should I swap it? I'm not letting that go. I could put some... It looks like I can carry lots of stuff. Why not? Oh, a message bottle. I'll put this rock down. <laughs> okay. To a friend I've yet to meet, our weather was so nice today that I went for a long walk. On my walk, I thought up this DIY recipe. I didn't want to waste a good idea, so now I'm sharing this with you. It's simple if you have the parts. Wishing you well, Gala. Gala. I wonder who Gala is. A wooden mosaic wall. A wooden mosaic wall. I wonder what that looks like. That fish is gone. Butterfly. Come here. How, why am I having so much trouble with this butterfly? <laughs> there we go. Oh no! The end of the line for my flimsy net. This is terrible. Your tools break? I guess that's why they would say flimsy, right? Oh, I'm so close. I just gotta catch some more fish. Okay. Wait, I missed something else. I'm really trashed tools. You get nook miles based on how many tools you've broken. Okay. The next one is 20. That's a pretty high mark there. I dropped a stone. I pick up a stone. <laughs> Let's sell some stuff. I am offering a yellow butterfly, another yellow butterfly, a common butterfly. I have two horse mackerels. And a moth. I got two moths. And some seashells. I need to sell seashells, right? That's what I got on offer today. You're going to love it. All quality stuff. You'll love it. High quality. 1,000 bells. Even? That's suspicious. You got anything else for me, Tom? I found a creature. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, this bug. What a catch. I do believe this is a wharf roach. Hmm, if this island can support a wharf roach. Why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here. An old friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Ah, blathers. Would you be okay with that? Uh, yeah. I guess. This is in no way tied to your generous donation now, but I have a useful app to show you. I love that the apps download here. I sent you the Critterpedia app. It's a terrific resource for an inspiring island researcher such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs and fish you catch. Yes, yes. I do hope you'll continue to fill up your discoveries and share them with me too. I'm sure you'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward, huh? Okay, I've got to build something. I think this will probably be the end of my stream here, because I've got to go move along with my day for a little bit. I don't have clay. Can I build that yet? Nope, I need hardwood. That's what the mosaic wall looks like. Very cool. Very cool. A slingshot. I need a bug net. Can I craft it in bulk? Can I do multiples of my crafting? I'll get two of these just in case. I probably better make another fishing pole too. And... 
What do the little acorn icons in the background mean? Do those tell you how rare they are? Like this one has gold acorns. Does it tell you that you need wood? Yeah, wood and leaves and stones. Okay, that's probably what the background means. Let's make a bed. I'll go put this bed, this bed. Oh wait, I meant to be all done. I'll go put that bed in my house. So when I have a slumber party, somebody can have a little bed. It's nice that you can sit on this little cushion there. <laughs> oh, have I done it? Have I done it? Ah, oh, I need 50 more Nook Miles. I am so close. There's still some here somewhere. Where are they? No, here we go. I'm a full-fledged consumer. All right, I've done it. I've paid off my tent. This is a perfect place to end. What's the active island resident? I should check that one out. Oh, you can flick the right stick down to go down faster. There you go. Based on the number of active days. Okay, so that just means you check in. I'll do the bug thing later. Yeah, my debt. About my moving fees. I can do it finally, Nook. Yes. Yes, yes. You owe 5,000 miles. I'm ready to pay. Thank you so much. Indeed, this 5,000 miles and not a mile less. With that, your moving fees have been paid in full. This is a happy day for both. Yes, yes. You're free and clear of debt. Living on a thriving scenic island. What could be better? Oh, that wasn't actually a rhetorical question. Let me be more specific. Oh, no. He's planning something. He has that devious look on his face. How is that tent treating you? It is great. Is yeah, that so? That's wonderful to hear. I'm so pleased to see that you're enjoying your new island life. Indeed, establishing a sort of utopia was one of the main aims of this endeavor. Along with profits, of course. But I knew it. I knew he was up to something. He's a slick salesman. Did you see how he rolled with that resistance? I sort of tried to give him a no answer, and he just... He made it sound like I gave him the answer he wanted, and is still bending it to his will. Nook, you sly devil. Speaking of this paradise, couldn't it be even better? Yes, yes, I suppose the time has come is right to discuss the possibility of building custom homes. There are certain challenges to building fabulous homes in a remote location. Challenges that do translate directly into costs, I'm afraid. But with zero... Oh, there's my timer. It must be time to quit. But with zero interest financing and an extremely lax repayment plan, anything is possible. He does have very good loan terms, I'll give him that. Zero interest and pay it off when you want? That's unreal. Of course, the U.S. just lowered the interest rate to zero, the Federal Reserve. So we're sort of, this is like real life here. So Jimmy, if you ever find yourself interested in a new home, do come see me. One more thing to share. We have a Miles Redemption service for Nook Miles you've collected. When you access the Nook Stop, you can redeem them for lots of interesting things. Be sure to check it out. Well then, I hope to continue your, I hope you continue your getaway life. Okay, well I never wanted a house before, but now I must have one. Yeah, the Fed lowered the interest rates to zero. And people are doing, they're like delaying mortgage payments and stuff. So this is sort of like real life right now. About my home. Oh, Jimmy, you've made a decision about home ownership, ready to move forward? Yes. As fun as living in a tent can be, a house gives you more space and helps you put down more roots. Now building a house means taking on a new loan of 98,000 bells. I guess so. Let's do it. It's a teeny home, right? You get to choose from eight different colors for the roof. Please select a roof color. Okay. Red, pink, yellow, black. Blue, aqua, green, purple. Hmm. I do a green roof? Sure, let's do green. One more thing. Homeowners get an automatic Nook Mileage program upgrade. Just give me one moment. Oh. How does it upgrade? There we go. I've updated your program membership details, Jimmy. Now when you use the Nook Miles app, you'll have access to all the Nook Miles Plus benefits. Oh. Nook Miles Plus includes a nifty way to earn additional miles. 
You'll see the details when you launch the app, so please give it a look when you can. That's all for me. Your wonderful new home should be ready tomorrow. Yes, yes. Tomorrow in real days, right? I found a creature. Another creature? Let's have a look at that one. A moth. Is this how I donate to the museum without Blathers being here? Yep, yep, send it all to Blathers. I'm gonna make Blathers so excited about the life on this island that he will be here faster. I have been taking advantage of the workbench. I did see you tinkering around over there just a few minutes ago. That reminds me, I've been meaning to share some DIY recipes with you. Mind turning on your phone? So he's given me more recipes, I think, because I am giving him stuff, like bugs and things. A number of DIY recipes that require wood. <gasps> an axe, finally! I've been needing an axe. So many things are made of wood, right? I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries. Okay, well, I know I said I was going to be done, but I think I'm going to try and empty out my pockets here. I wish I could do this in multiples, right? A fish in a bag. Yep, yep, send it to Blathers. I'm gonna have a full museum by the time he gets here. Ah, <gasps> flowers! Thank you, Nook! A red wind flower bag. Just a little sampling of a product. You know, my purpose of doing this was to get rid of my pockets, and you're filling my pockets back up. Not that I'm complaining about it. I've got some more critters for you. I found another critter. A horse mackerel. Yep, send it along, send it along. The flowers that grow will be very strong. That'll, they'll spring up even if you just plant them and forget them. But if you water them each day, that's where the magic happens. Watering opens up the possibilities of propagating and crossbreeding your flowers to develop rare colors. Oh, cool. How might you water them, you ask? Well, I've just sent you the DIY recipe for a watering can. My accountant warned me about giving this sort of thing away for free, but you've collected creatures for me, Jimmy, so this is just part of the island give and take. I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all a part of the island experience, yes, yes. I didn't know that I was going to be getting so much stuff from him for doing this. So bring all of your things to Nook and give them to him. You want a butterfly? It's just common. Yeah, you can, ten you can send it to Blathers. I don't know if I've sent him one of those already. Hold the phone, someone's calling. Blathers, is that you? Oh, what splendid timing. Yes, yes, do you remember the venture we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I am currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Tonight Show. The local fauna are as abundant as expected, just as I told you. I knew he was going to get Blathers excited about this. How many, precisely? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet, but I have received, let's see, five outstanding specimens so far. Seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm with a customer right now. I'm not a customer, Nook. I thought we were friends. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Nook will never be your friend. You're always a customer to him. Believe it or not, he's cold-hearted. He's coming. He's going to come to our island to help us identify and preserve the local creatures. But I could use your help. Since you've done so much scouting and collecting, would you be able to find a spot for Blathers? We need a good-sized space to build out a world-class museum, so keep that in mind. It's all coming together, yes, yes. All right. Oh. So I don't... I don't actually have to give him any more things. I think your home will be ready by tomorrow. I'm so excited for you. Let, let's craft one more thing. I'm hoping I can make a pole. I can't make a pole yet. 
that I can make an axe. Okay. <laughs> I'm having a hard time. I was gonna be done and now there's a new thing. The loop in this game, it's unreal. Just one more thing, just one more thing. Do I have that bug? It's a common butterfly, I have that one. All right, here we go. Chop, chop, chop. Oh, if you hit the button faster, you chop faster. I'll chop really fast here. Chop, chop, chop. I saw a butterfly over here that I didn't know about. The bulletin board is where we share information with the residents, but we'd love it if visitors would leave a nice note, you know, promote friendly communication. Oh, he didn't seem to like that, did he? A yellow butterfly. For some reason, that one looked different to me. I guess it was all the same. Where should I put my museum? Should I put my museum on the other side of the river? I should probably put it next to Island Services, actually. Yeah, like right here. It would look nice up by that waterfall. Okay, okay, I'm almost done here. Oh, I don't have a recipe for a flimsy pole. I guess my museum maybe has to be where he wants it. Log stakes? Can I make a fence with those? Okay, well, I guess I gotta pick the museum. I can't pick it across the river. That solves that dilemma. So we'll put the museum... Not there. Maybe just right here, I guess. It's a nice central location. Too close to the plaza. I don't want anything to get in the way here. Better choose another place. Okay. Can I put it right here? Let me imagine it. I don't want to block that little house. Yeah, sure, that's good. He just has a tent that's so cool. A little museum tent. <laughs> it's totally in the way of this tent. Hopefully it doesn't make it too hard for them to see their mailbox. Okay, well, I think that's it for today, so thanks for watching. I will maybe be back later. I got some real life chores to take care of, so until next time, don't forget to slip slap slop and mirror posh shame. <laughs>